Modern Tea, a fresh look at an ancient, ancient beverage by Lisa Bolt Richardson, photogra photographs by Jennifer Altman, and this is an ebook e version on that I got through Overdrive uh, through my local library, and it I'm able to put it on my Kobo. I'm not too sure if it is available on Kindles, so people can tell me below if. Overdrive is available on Kindle for those who do have it, who have that instead of a Kobo. And like, I found this book really interesting. So instead of like other books would focus on either just the different types of tea and growing and how it gets from A to, a to B or a bit of a history of it. This one combines those and goes into different areas that tea can be used other than drinking. So like recipe, recipe wise. So, and so what is tea, where it's grown and how, and how it becomes specialty tea, specialty tea. Chapter two goes the art of tea, buying, storing, steep, steeping and tasting so it goes into so that is like the tasting part of it's like how to do your own tea ta tea tasting like how to set it up like if you do it yourself or you do it with a group chapter three goes is tea ceremonies and rituals ex experiencing tea in many different ways so you get the classic Chinese and Japanese tea ceremonies. Then you get other, the other like uh, Korean. So uh, like Korean. You also get the British, <laughs> like British afternoon tea kind of thing, and. She goes through like Western and Eastern ways of drinking tea and how like Western and Eastern tea, tea drinkers are like similar or how they're different. So chapter four, Beyond the Cup, pairing, cooking, cocktails, and more. So what tea goes with what food and how to br bring tea into your cooking, infusing, and so forth. The buzz about tea is chapter five. So caffeine, health, coffee, and sustainability. So like organic, fair trade, caffeine levels, differing, differing between like coffee and tea, what the caffeine levels are. And you get some resources, a selected bibliography in it, and okay, so this is what I'm looking. So you get information like what is tea, how it's grown, what is specialty tea, how tea becomes, how tea leaves become a tea, the six classes of tea. So you get white, green, Chinese green, Japanese green. Yellow tea, which is rarely, uh, rarely seen outside of China. Oolong tea, black tea, and dark tea. So the art of buying, storing, and steeping tea. Uh, water, types of kettle, like using a kettle, teapot, using an infuser. So how to make hot tea, Western and Eastern style water temperatures and steeping. So a lot of this so far you can see in other tea books. And then the art of tasting teas, tasting tea in five steps. So like looking and smelling the tea when it's dried, like 
and doing the same one, it, it's all steeped and everything. So, so you get Chinese, Japanese, Taiwanese, English tea ceremonies, like afternoon tea, tips for tea drinking, and like tips for eating, like in the tea and uh, English tea ceremonies, uh, Moroccan tea ceremony, tea time French style, Russian rituals, and then you do get a small little section about tea and meditation. So, and being a professional tea taster is also in there as well. And then like smoking with, smoking with tea, tea cocktails, uh, infusing simple syrup with tea. Uh, you get for healing, your body and beauty for the garden. So for your home and things you could do with like empty tea tins. So, and then you get the sustainability portion, uh, tea tin accessories. It goes in a few different countries uh, for the resources, tea and tea accessories. So North America, and then United Kingdom and France. Electric kettles and water heaters, tea associations and trade show. And then the selected bibliography. And so it does go into a wide range of topics. And it's really interesting to see the different information that she does put in this book. And I have been having myself read some books about tea. So I some of this is repeated information, but some of it is new. So you do get a lot of information. You do get one or two little tidbits of personal information about her as a person, as a tea drinker and researching the information in this for this book. So it really interesting information, a really nice look at tea. And if you are a person or know a person who is a tea drinker and likes to know more than other than, oh, I like this tea. <laughs> so it is a book to have a look at, whether you get an ebook version or the physical copy. So Modern Tea, A Fresh Look at an Ancient Beverage by Lisa Bolt Richardson. Happy readings.